Hi guys, back with another video for Capital City Pop. Today I will be going on a pop hunt with my sister. I'm very excited for this. Uh, she just kind of like wanted to do something like this for like a, about a week or two. And I thought, hey, why not? I'm going to go pick her up at work. And uh, we'll go on a pop hunt in a place called Salem Raw. Which there's quite a few places to go hunting for pops. So I'm pretty excited too. Because I haven't done that in a while. So we'll see what's out there. Alright, I'll see you guys in a bit. So here at Sailor Ram Mall, and I'm with my sister. Say hey. Hey. What's up? What's up? Mm -hmm. All right. So we're gonna go to uh, Sketchers. No, Sketchers. Um, Spencer. Spencer's. We're gonna go Spencer's. <laughs> and we're gonna go to uh, Sunshine Sunrise Records. I always say Sunshine. I'm Sunshine. sorry for that. <laughs> yeah, because you, you. I don't know. It's kind of funny, but yeah. Anyways, yeah. I, oh yeah, Toys R Us as well. For you American people that can't go to Toys R Us anymore. <laughs> that was for you, Corey. <laughs> All right, see you guys in a bit. So we're at Spencer's. Are you excited? Yeah. Yeah, very excited. Now let's go. Let's go get it. Yeah. So finally at the Toys R Us, you ready to be a big kid? I'm a big kid now. Yeah, <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> So when we're at we're at Sunrise Records. Ready to get sunrise. some Sunrise. Sunrise, not sunrise. sunshine. Sunrise. Sunrise. <laughs> Let's go. Hey guys, so back at the house after doing a hunt with my sister at Sailor Round Mall here in Ottawa. And uh, she had a lot of fun, I had a lot of fun, and she even said in the future she wants to do some more hunt videos. 
Um, comment down below if you want to see that again. Uh, we had a lot of fun, like I said. Um, I didn't pick up any Funkos today, but I picked up some previous in the month. But today I picked up two things that are Dragon Ball related. Uh, so the first one I picked up at EB Games, which is GameStop in the States, was this Gogeta figure from Dragon Ball Super Broly the movie. Very, very cool figure. Um, as you can see, there's six figures in total. So there's a, a Vegeta there, there's a Goku, a Frieza, Paragus, who is Broly's father, and Broly. And then there's the one I have right there, Gogeta. Yes, I had a lot of fun finding this. Um, I've been looking for a lot of Dragon Ball Broly stuff, but I didn't see anything till today. Um, and I also saw this figure, which is actually a Bam Presto uh, Dragon Ball Super Broly Broly from the movie. Um, I'm very excited to open up this, and I can't wait to see how it looks. I've been looking for this since I first saw it announced. I think it was on a Big Bad Toy Store or something. I just was looking one day, and I happened to see it. And I'm very, very happy that it finally came in. I paid no, nowhere near to what I thought I was going to be paying for this. Um, I paid $30, um, and I thought it was going to be like $45, $50 when it got released, so I feel like I've, I've won here. Um, yeah, very, very excited, but enough talking. I'm going to see these out of box, and uh, yeah, just give me one second. All right, for the first figure, we have Gogeta. Which, yes, is very, very small, but it was it's very well detailed for what it is, um, as you can see. Very, very tiny figure, as you can see in comparison to, to me. But, uh, yeah, it comes on a stand uh, with a little peg that goes in the back of his leg uh, to hold him up. Which is weird, because normally, uh, for these figures, they, they have pegs in the stand. So, it was a little different to see that, but I'm not uh, disappointed at all about it, so... And then we have uh, the Broly figure from Dragon Ball Super Broly the movie, and un unbelievable. I, I can't believe the level of detail in this character, as you can see. Very, very cool. Definitely like worth way more than uh, 30 bucks. Uh, I couldn't believe that I found that. And then, yes, I have some Funkos. Hold your horses. I know this is a Funko channel. <laughs> I have Hit from the Dragon Ball Super TV show. Try all you like. It won't work. And it doesn't matter how tough you are either. If I keep striking your critical points, you will eventually die. I recommend you surrender. And then I also have Master Roshi, which is also from the um, Dragon Ball Super TV show. But he's also in Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z as well. Um... So yeah, very very cool. The reason this is the super version is because his sunglasses are the super version. Um, his whole look, his sandals. I'll show them out of box in a second. But yeah, very very cool. I like these both. I'm gonna take them out of box to show you guys. Just give me a second. So first up, we have Hit, who's an assassin from the Dragon Ball Super. Series. He's also a fighter, but like he's known to be an assassin in the universe he's from. There, he's not actually from the same universe as the characters, the Z fighters, um, as they're known. Um, but yeah, he's a very menacing character. I love how they get his calm demeanor with the hands in the pocket, and uh, it very it shows very well to what the show comparison of his character is. As, as close as you can get in pop form. So I'm very, very happy to get this. I got this from a guy named Samuel LaPratt. I actually traded Black uh, Panther, Venomized Black Panther for this, which is about the same value. So very, very good trade. And I'm very happy to get this over that pop, as cool as it is. And then I also have the Master Roshi Max Power. As you can see, his muscles are pretty big. And there's this... Quite a bit of definition considering it's a pop figurine. Um, and then in the series, usually he has black sunglasses, black and red sunglasses. But in the super version, he actually has green and blue sunglasses and some green sandals over the regular sandals he wears, I believe, or shoes. I'm not too sure. I'll have to look at the pop later. But uh, I love this character. Um, 
in Super, and I think that people have forgotten about Master Roshi until this series. Um, in Dragon Ball Z, he wasn't around very much. He, most of the time, he's just hanging around, not doing nothing. So it was nice to see him do some fighting scenes in the series. Come on! Come and get some of this! They don't call me Master Roshi for nothing, you know! Um, very, very awesome pop. I got this from a place called Leisure Entertainment yesterday, actually. Um, probably a week from now, considering this video might come out a bit longer away from when I got these. So, but yeah, very, very cool pop. So that's all I have to show you guys. I hope you enjoyed the pops. I hope you enjoyed the figures. Uh, and I hope you enjoyed me and my sister having fun and silly times together because we always do. Um, and it has been a, quite a while since I've seen her and I hope to see her some more. And as I said, she probably will be in videos in the future. All right, so thank you so much, guys. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything I'm putting out in the future. And as I always say, keep living, loving, and collecting. And I'll see you in the next video, okay, guys? All right, take care. Bye.